Ooh. You've come, you've come. Ah! The gift lasts the tender flesh. I've come here to do just that, you wretch. Show it to me, show it to me. Your door, you're longing for that wish of yours. This is ridiculous! I've already been to your grove, I've cleared your trial. What else is it that you want from me? Your commitment, your commitment. Show it to me, Lassie, your commitment. Uh oh. Oh no. The cursed version of the wood. Oh, I see. gonna be rough. I have to get in there and get this over with. Don't know how to do it. Oops. Pro, it's gone. Where the tender flesh? Hmm. It's got my hair in it. It'll do, I suppose. It's best I get out of here. The sooner, the better. When did I? It's that dream again, but I was in town just now.
You again. Didn't you hear me? We'll be late for his banquet if you don't hurry. Banquet, where are you? Huh? It's the morning already? I don't feel like I got any sleep at all. Let's take go find Rosemarine. Eat the apple strudel. It look like today. The unicorn again. Look. I'm begging you, flock. Mm. What's going on out there? And yeah, nothing back here. Oh, please stay put, Flock. What's gotten into him? Uh, ah, Elise, he's throwing a temper tantrum is all. Didn't know goats could do such a thing. Uh, I had my hands full with breakfast, I couldn't give him much attention. Uh, it's what you get for spoiling him so much, that's what. Uh, I know, but I can't resist his sweet little hops. For truly... Are you feeling better today, Elise? Uh, you still haven't told me about what happened. I can't tell her the full extent of it, can I? How about what I saw in the woods or about her? Sorry, I... Are you listening, Elise? I huh? Like You're telling me about the woods. That fellow got lost in the woods, that's all. I went in there to rescue him, I suppose. <laughs> You're not telling me the whole truth, are you? Eh. Yeah. Please. You know, I... There's someone in those woods, Rosemarine. I don't know who they are, or what they want from me, but... I've felt their presence here since Monday. Oh, that's... Someone in the woodland, you say? I'm certain they hurt... I'm certain they hurt Apfel, or lowered him in, even. <laughs> Have you seen that old hag again, Lise? The one who told you about him and the Testaments? I haven't seen that old hag since then, but that Rosemarine I met in the woods. I don't know what to make of any of this, do I? I'm sorry, I... Elise? Come, Ozer Marine, we should move along. Uh, but... Well, it's best you go ahead without me, Elise. I think I'd best find Flock. I'll be right there with you. <sighs> Alright. I'd best go chase after Flock. I didn't see where he ran off to, did you? Ah, oh, that's alright, Elise. I'll lower him out with a carrot or two, you'll see. I only hope he hasn't wandered into town. I'll find him, you'll see. Ah, same. Okay. So what was that other objective, though? I'll save back here. And load up this. Find your way home. Okay, what if I go home instead?
I wonder if I go home. I wonder if it'll just do the whole thing anyway. Maybe getting the key wasn't really necessary. Ah, okay, so... Can't go home anyway. Okay. Head to the village. Oh? This gift does suit you rather well, lass. Eh. Oh. Those shoes, they'll guide you to him. What in the Lord's name? Who are you? You know who I am, Elise. Uh, You're with him, just like that crow. Quite smart, aren't you? you know, I... This is another of his trials, I take it. Why, yes, you're truly so delightful, lass. Eh? Fortune, that's what you are after, is it? Hmm. You've come to taunt me, I'm assuming. I've come to welcome you into my very own garden, Elise. You alone, lass. I won't let that wretched thing into my grove unlike... Vry, that fool. Testament, you seek rest deep within my depths, Elise. Am I to meet you there, then? My, how willful you are. You're trying my patience, that's what. We both know what I'm after, Serpent, so get it over with, Anne. Ooh. You're not the bearer of my hex, lassie, fated to meet me in my realm. Tell me your resolve, your burning desire for more. Be good, behave, Elise, and I welcome you with open arms. You sickening wretch! I'll be awaiting you by the gates of my bedewed forest of berries, Elise. Ooh. The hell with you! Ah, the stings! Best I don't alarm Rosamarine. I have to prepare myself for tonight. I must see this through. Ah, anything up here? They don't have the... anything to do... Ooh, there's sparkles. Arnate tore your horse. Cool. Flowers in a braided mane. are all gone. That's good. Nope, nothing in here. The rocks are still caved in, I believe. Yeah. I'll buy your lonesome today, Elise. My cousin's taking a little longer to get ready today, is all. Oh, I'm so glad you're getting along, dearie. You could use the company. Why doesn't she stay here in Kieferberg? Ah, uh, I'm not too certain about that, Granny Gretel. Hey, Elise, there's a favor I'd like to ask you. Would you keep an eye on Lipkachin for me today? She's sick, or...? She wasn't feeling her best this morning, yet insisted on going to church. That Lipkachin. You go give her a proper earful for me, will you? 
I don't have a good word with Lepkuchin. She can't keep going on like this. And I'm kind of rich. Alright, anything can buy? Ah, now that I get the apple strudel. Hmm. Probably get some backup for the mind. I wouldn't want to be a burden for you. Not at all, Miss Elizabeth. It would be my pleasure. I like good morning, Elise. Everything all right? I was inviting Miss Elizabeth and the children for dinner. I don't think that we're ready for that yet, my dear. Well, the invitation stands, Miss Elizabeth. You're welcome any time you'd like. How's that, Phil, Miss Elizabeth? Oh, Elise, I have so many questions. He hasn't slept. He keeps mentioning the witch. Witch? What happened in the woods, Elise? I didn't see anything resembling a witch, that's for certain. That fell still frightened, Miss Elizabeth. My apologies, Elise. It wasn't my intention to insinuate. That's all right, Miss Elizabeth. I know you meant no harm. Oh, I hope nothing else happens today. Truly, everything seems to be getting worse lately. Oh, I feel I'm losing my mind, lad. I have to stay strong, Miss Mario. What happened, Mr. Guido? Haven't you heard, Elise? Windmill was ransacked even though the door was locked sh locked shut all night. Huh? I don't want to think about it, if I'm honest. It could have been one of us folks too, or even the witch. Oh, I don't say that, Guido. These folks are losing their minds. I can only hope they don't turn on me. At least they are. are you listening? Hmm, what? So tired from yesterday? Unless we don't shoot it over too much, I'd say. Keeping our mouth shut won't make it go away, Brunhild. Just watch my mouth today. Here to lend Lepkuchin a hand, lass? What are you talking about, Mr. Wilhelm? Haven't you heard? Folks are gathering like bees inside that church. Because of the windmill and grain? Precisely, folks are going crazy. Some say it was the witch, others say it was the devil himself. Wait, Mr. Wilhelm. What does any of this have to do with Lepkuchin? Ah, it's best you go see for yourself, lass. This can't be good. Oh, I'm glad I had a word with Lipkachin this morning. The folks are completely losing their minds. They certainly are, Miss Birchchild. At least this has to be taken seriously. My, I wouldn't want to blame poor Eugene, but... You'd best not say it, Birchchild. This is a matter to be handled by Father Hands. Whatever it is, I don't think it's anything to fret about. How can you see such a thing, lass? Let's try to keep our composure, ladies. If Oddly is right, we'd best wait for Father Hand's judgment. I ought to be careful what I say about town today. These folks are rabid. Use that key then. What are you hiding up here in the back street? Nothing in the stalls.
I suppose I won't be getting in here anytime soon, huh? Do I still have the key? Nope. No save point there anymore, too. Sparkling up there. I don't think anybody's in the back streets here. Nobody on this side. Nobody on this side either. Save. They even go see what's in that well. Washing well is empty. That note, and the key. Whoever's been doing these rituals may have tempered with this faucet. Okay, in that case. Use. I've done it. it fit! What in the Lord's name is going on in Kieferberg? one of these caves. I'm starting to feel queasy again. Together, I have to pull myself together and get this over with. Matches. Matches. Alright. Cool. Oh, I see. now, but there's still something missing, I think. There's something in there, but I can't reach it. It's going really bright, too. Uh. Can't reach it. Ah. This. Come on. That reentry. This was ripped out of some journal. Most of this was jotted down in a hurry, but... Walpurga the witch, I've uncovered her roots at last. Everything points back to Kieferberg, the birthplace of the witch, Walpurga and her cult. This can't be. If there truly is a witch in Kief Kieferberg, then... Adored and celebrated for centuries, the woodland surrounding this town was said to have a consciousness of its own. This consciousness, what we now call a witch, was named Walpurga. Folk's faith in its miracles dates from many years before the glory of the church reached, its, reached these peaks. Said to grant its believers good health, sustenance, and protection. Woodland or Walpurga harbored folk's wills, wishes, desires, and sins. In such a way, in fact, that it would appear to folks under the guise of a woman. Whisper to the faithful, take the form of their beloved ones, of an old hag, of a doe, amongst others. The six-ringed maypole, the symbol of St. Walpurga's benevolence we adore today.
was first adored as the symbol of the witch's miracles and mercy. That is no more, however. St. Walpurga is a patroness of the church, a benevolent figure in our faith. With the arrival of the Lord's messengers to these peaks, the cult of Walpurga was eradicated. It is fact, however, that the few who lived have become nomads of sorts. What is the most puzzling to me is that in my research in all of this history, it doesn't quite align with Old Hall's confession. Alperga the witch never once was said to ask anything in return for its blessings. Neither was it ever referred to as a god or a male entity, rather a woman. How could he have granted Old Hall a wish? This witch, how could a pagan deity do what the Lord himself won't? I am fairly certain there is more to Old Hall's sins than meets the eye. Granny Hall's sins, he says. None of this is true. Father Hans is losing his wits. Granny Hall would never... She wouldn't ever hide anything from me. Oh? The path ends here, but it looks to me like it caved in. I wonder if this used to connect somewhere. Hmm. I have to come back, aren't I? Can't reach it. Okay. You have the key, right? I do not. Hmm. I need something to reach that. Something to extend reach. Wonder. Nothing here. However, I can buy an oil. Okay. You've got to clear out the blockage, folks. It's the only way. You say so, lad. What's wrong with the fountain? One thing after another, isn't it, Elise? You think the fountain's obstructed is all. Is all her doing, the witch. She's taken our grain, our children, and now she's after our water. We've discussed this, old lad. Finn and I can give it a look, can't we, Finn? The best of our ability, but... Old Wilhelm ought to know what's wrong with it. We're together here at noon, folks. I want to have a word with all of Kieferberg. I'll need to lend a hand, Father. Naturally, Gustav. What are we to do about the green, folks? The green? You haven't heard, lass. No, I've yet to fully understand what's going on. Someone was in the mill last night, at least. It could have been the wind, or the crow still. The door was still locked this morning, lad. It was Eugene's responsibility, but... It was the witch, I tell you. Give it a rest, old jockin. I was told you left home early last night, at least. She was certainly tired, old jockin. Don't be unreasonable. Couldn't have been one of us, folks. What about the weevils? Weevils, Mr. Ludwig? The flour and grain we had stored away are riddled with beetles, at least. I'm not certain what we're going to do with this grain now. All we can do is avoid throwing it out, Ludwig. We'll become completely reliant on a Primaldor for this, right? 
that witch has us at our mercy. She has all of Kieferberg in the palm of her hand, and... That's enough, folks. I've heard enough. Ben and the Heinrich will take a look at the fountain later. As for the rest of us, we ought to air out that grain and do away with those beetles starting right now. This is only riling folks up even more. I must go see if Lipkachin's alright. Folks must be swarming her. <laughs> 